Hey guys, so today, as you can notice, I am doing my first voiceover. So I will be talking about the picture, how I came up with the idea, etc, etc. So the inspiration for this picture came up when I saw Kelly release Chinese New Year the horse picture, which I will link down below, which inspired me to start a geisha themed picture. So this picture took a lot of time to finish because I wanted to add so many details and I also wanted to make it simple. So also I didn't want it to be a straight up copy from her picture so it also took a very long time to make it more original and less copied from hers. So first of all I started sketching out some ideas on my sketchbook so I would have a clear idea of what I wanted to draw before I went into the great paper quality because it's really expensive and I just used the, this kind of paper for my finished illustrations so I wanted to make sure that I had the finished picture and I wouldn't mess up when I started drawing so after I finished getting my ideas ready and I started ske sketching it out on the A3 piece of paper um, also it took a very long time because I wanted to firstly draw all the details in pencil so then I would be sure what I wanted to ink and what not when I was inking. So then well, what I'm doing now is inking which also took a very long time because I had to add some thickness to some places so it would be more dy dynamic. So also you may notice that it has a very weird shape to it, which is inspired by Kelly's picture, although I did change it up a little bit so it wouldn't look directly copy. Um, now I am inking the clothes and the earrings, which I don't know where I got the idea from, but it was just in my mind and I decided to do it. So, also why it took so long is because I researched the geisha picture so I would be sure that I included real things that geisha people wear so now I am inking the kimono which also took very long because I wanted to make sure that I got all the folds right and yeah so pretty soon we're getting to the coloring now I am finishing the inking and now I'm inking the kimono and I added so many folds, like I can't even count them. Um, now I'm making the hand, and now the kimono, and now we're getting to the color. So now I'm coloring it, which also took a very long time because of the makeup, which I wanted it to look natural, although it is a weird, it's a weird color because when I researched the geisha pictures in Google, I found out that they were, they were that they were purple blush, which I really haven't seen before anywhere, but I decided to add it anyways. So also I was trying to use the same colors throughout the whole picture so it would have more harmony to it. And also this is why it took so long because I had to complement the colors without making them straight up next to each other and also not making them really far apart. So now you can see the thing on her hair that I colored the same color as her eyes and I added a lot of gold also. Now I'm adding detail with my jelly roll pen and now I am getting into the hair which I learned out of, out of video. I also added some more detail so it would look more natural and not like a blob of grey hair, you know, and also because I wanted to make it dark, darker so it wouldn't look like she's a, an old lady, lady. So also now we're getting into the clothes, reason. yeah. So also the kimono took very long to color because I wanted to add a lot of shadows and one of my markers, the lighter color that I was using, ran out of ink while I was finishing the kimono. So that is one of the reasons also that it looked really bad because I also didn't have any refills for that specific color and well, yeah, 
I had to really push through it. So now there, for a, for a split second there was a very bad lighting because the lighting hit me from the um, right side. So because the light was very strong, you my my hand shadow was covering the entire picture. But later when I found out that I turned down the the strength of the light so it wouldn't cover the entire picture, my hands shadow. So now yeah I'm finishing the picture which I later added the um, background out of camera because it took very long. But yeah no you can see it. And I also added lots of details with my jelly roll pen to make sure it would look good. So thanks for watching and bye guys.